Good morning, boys and girls. It's Mrs. Vincent. I get the chance to check in with you today, and I know Miss Maciel had a really cool adventure with her kids yesterday where she left you some little surprises around Canton, and I know that I plan on going out with my family today and looking for some of those rocks that Mrs. Maciel left out but we are gonna kinda squish together two activities into one. If you're someone that does live in the neighborhood in Canton, and you go out on one of those adventures looking for Miss Maciel's rocks, um, we are doing it as well, but we're also gonna add in that scavenger hunt. If you haven't seen, um, there is a, a Facebook page for parents if you're interested, where they are doing um, like window, window art scavenger hunts, and this week's challenge is spring flowers. So take a few minutes, it can be something simple. It can be a piece of paper, construction paper, crayons, markers, whatever you've got available to just draw some spring flowers and stick them up in your window um, so that when people go out on their walk hunting for rocks, we're also gonna go out looking for that window art as well. We've been exploring new blocks on the neighborhood, even though a lot of times they're really close to our house, we just, often follow uh, the same path to get to certain places. So we've been trying new streets, see if we can find this window art, and now we get to search for rocks as well. So it's a little bit of a challenge day two if you're interested in adding some of those spring flower artwork. And for us, we've been working on decorating our door. So we've got some decorations down the bottom and the top. Um, so look on windows and doors and my kids get really excited when they find something and it honestly gives us some new ideas a lot of times for some crafts that we can do at home. Um, if you're feeling bold and adventurous and want to dig out some paint, go for it. Try some paint, tissue paper. We've used old magazines and made a flower using like a collage technique. So each petal on the flower is a different color and we go through and we cut up old magazines um, and it can be like anything. You just take that little like block of color, red or orange or yellow, and that makes up um, the part of the one petal. And it's really cool to see your picture kind of start to develop um, with this collage technique. So just some ideas for you out exploring whatever neighborhood you live in, even if you don't live in Canton. I'm sure we all love to decorate our homes and make us feel that spring is right around the corner because it is going to be May before we know it. Um, so I hope you guys are all enjoying both scavenger hunts, the window art and Miss Maciel's rock hunt. Um, but until next time, I love you all, I miss you all, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.